I'm Kelly Fast and this is the Frugal Family Farm. And today I'm gonna to show you guys what we do for Valentine's Day. It's become one of our favorite family traditions and I absolutely love it. What we do is we have a love dinner. And yes, we call it a love dinner. When my little girl was three years old, we celebrated Valentine's Day together. And she called it a love dinner and she got dressed up in her fanciest church dress and we decorated the table and we had candles and we rolled up the silverware with a napkin and we made it super fancy and she loved it. So ever since then, it has become our family tradition. Now what we do, and you can do this depending on the age of your kids, is we had our plates. Um, you can use paper, use what you have, whatever fits your budget. But we got these paper doilies and you put them on and you write before dinner, while dinner's finishing up, you have everyone write what they love about each family member on their plate. Then we sit down and we started eating and we just enjoyed the family time that we had together. And I decorate the table and it's super easy and it's super fun. And I save these decorations so each year I don't have to buy, I don't have to pay the money for them. So we found this at the dollar store and I just wrap it around all the candles and the plates and the food and we make it super festive. And I have some floral picks for when we do get fresh flowers at a super great price that I stick these in and I make my own floral arrangement. And then, look how cute this is. This came from the Dollar Tree, you guys. Um, it's for a dollar. It was a cute little banner to hang up. So this is love every moment. And that is so true. So that's why I got it, because it's adorable. So we do a love dinner. We have Martinelli's, we have Kool-Aid, and whichever, it depends on the year, how much money I want to spend on our love dinner. But it's the best. We don't have to wait in line at a restaurant. We don't have to pay a babysitter and our kids get to spend some quality time with us, which I think that's what this holiday is all about. Spending quality time with those that you love. The other thing on Valentine's Day is you have to, if you have kids, you get to take Valentine's to all of their, their classmates. And that is expensive and time consuming. So. I have a simple, easy hack for you, and it involves a bag of six lids. Now, I got these at my grocery store for $1.29, and there's 21 six lids packages in here. So for my daughter's class size, this is perfect. Then you're going to take some of these dollar store foam stickers, and then here's the crazy part, but I do it with my preschoolers, so... Don't stress when I say permanent marker. <laughs> You're gonna give your kids a permanent marker. Watch them, tell them this doesn't come off your clothes, this doesn't come off your body, so I only need it on this sticker. And guess what? You'll be surprised that your kids can do it. So you're gonna give them a permanent marker and they can make it look like a conversation heart. So write BFF or be mine or talk to you later. You're gonna have them write on the heart and then put love and then a dash and then write their name. Because when you're passing out Valentine's in class, it's a little hard for them to find everybody and make it time consuming. So from a teacher's standpoint, because I teach preschool and I promise this is the way to go, just have them write their name. If you do get the pre-made Valentine's, put to my friend and then have your child put their name at the bottom. That way it will save them and the teacher time and I promise your teacher will love you for it. So what you're gonna do, you're gonna take your six lits and you're gonna take your foam sticker and you're gonna stick the six lits right there and squeeze. And there you go. You have an easy Valentine to hand out in class. So there's that. The other thing, if you love giving gifts to your kids, please don't make it about the gift. Make it about something you can do together or something that you have made for them. Don't go all crazy. Don't spend 20 bucks. You guys, it's not worth it. Most of that will be thrown away in a couple of months anyways. So this year for my daughter, I made her this cute little leather 
um, conversation heart snap clip for her hair. Cute. Look how cute that is. Um, make something, it'll be much more meaningful. And then the other thing that I do is I give my kids books. So if there's ever a holiday that we celebrate, um, I give them a book. And this book, we read it the next year, I read it in preschool, and my kids just love it. After we finish dinner, we sit down and we read a book. And that's, that's what this holiday is about. This holiday is supposed to be with those that you love and spending quality time with those that you love. So this Valentine's Day, I challenge you, do a love dinner and then tag me or put hashtag frugal family farm because I want to see you guys building these relationships with your family while staying on a budget and making it easy. So there's all my Valentine's Day tricks and I hope you enjoy and have a happy Valentine's Day.